Now, U.S. President-elect Donald Trump announced on Thursday, November 7, that his campaign manager, Susan Wiles, will be serving as his White House chief of staff, entrusting a top position to a political operative who helped him win this election. The appointment was, in fact, the first of what is expected to be a flurry of staffing announcements as Trump girds for a return to the White House on Jan 20th. Trump's 2.0 team, as we call it. Wiles will be the first woman to serve as a White House chief of staff. Two of the sources told Reuters that Wiles, a longtime Florida-based political strategist, is viewed as trustworthy and gets plots for helping to manage Trump's successful run for the presidency. As the gatekeeper to the president, the chief of staff typically wields great influence. The person manages White House staff, organizes the president's time and schedule and maintains contact with other government departments and lawmakers. Trump choose, chooses Wells over former House of Representatives Speaker Kevin McCarthy, a California Republican who is close to Trump and has been a frequent visitor to Mar-a-Lago. Susie likes to stay sort of in the back, let me tell you. The ice maiden, we call it... Appreciation for Susie and Chris, the job you did. <laughs> Susie, come, Susie, come here. Come here, Susie. Chris, come here, Chris. Susie likes to stay sort of in the back, let me tell you. The ice maiden, we call it the ice maiden.